Hello, hello! Welcome back to another episode of the X Wedlock. Last time we beat the Anistar City Gym and its leader Olympia. And we also managed to make our way through the Team Flare Secret HQ, which, well, actually no, it was the lab, Lysander Labs, which is which was a lot longer than I thought it was, <laughs> which is why last uh, last episode was so freaking long, so apologies for that. Um, but anyway, we're going to be heading through to the Team Flare Secret HQ in Geosenge Town for this episode, and hopefully we can stop the world from ending. I know, it's a big ask, it's a big task for a Pokemon game, but we'll have to see how we do here. The team is holding up well right now, so I'm happy. I'm happy. Everyone's doing well. Hollow clip? Oh no, okay. You're not gonna bug me. I don't know whether we've healed, but I'm gonna heal. We need to head off to GS Engine Town to find out what's happening with this flower thing. And we need to beat Lysander. Obviously, having to beat Lysander is going to be quite an interesting task because of the fact that, well, yeah, I uh, kind of need to find a way to beat his entire team with just two Pokemon. <laughs> I think I know who I'm going to use. I'm pretty sure I know who I'm going to use for this. Um, it's actually a bit of a no-brainer, um, to be quite honest, so we're just going to go with it. Um, but we'll, we'll see. We'll, we'll see. We shall see. Right. Here we go. Oh, I know I need to go to the back end of the uh, of the place. Oh, look, it's you. You'd better have come here prepared, both you and your Pokemon. Maybe. Grunty Face has a main neck trick. Who am I dealing with again? I don't actually know. Oh, Cola, right. I always love seeing a main trick when there's a um, when I have this pair out because yeah, luckily you're a grunt, so I'm not too fast. Not too fast. Hmm. It'd have been nice if that KO'd, but never mind. We got ice shard. This is what this is for. Lemon up to level fifty-one. A Scrafty. I feel like I've seen this team before. Maybe I have and you've just gained an extra Pokemon. Maybe. Maybe. Right, let's go with Dragon Claw. Just feel like it. I know that I can tank a high jump kick or a crunch, so... Not too fast. Hmm. Well, I wish that had KO'd, but... Never mind. Fire fang. Bye, Scrafty. Ginger beer up to level 51. And a gold bat, we're going to say. Uh, we are getting quite close to that level limit. I think when everyone reaches... Oh, actually, I, may, I might turn it off now, actually. Just because I'm thinking, if people start, if po people, if Pokemon start getting to level 52, then we are very much kicking very close to the level limit, and that's a little bit worrying because I don't really want to. So I think we're going to turn off the experience share briefly, and I'm going to go heal because there's no point in not doing so, really. It's intriguing to me that they stop you from going on to Route 10, but I think if you go from Silage City, you can go to Route 10. It's really weird. <laughs> it is really weird. I don't know why they do that. It's like we're keeping you here, even though you flew here. Like, okay. Sean, I'm coming with you. When I was in Lysander's lab, the masked heroes told me what is going on. They, I, I can't ever get her voice right. It's fine. We're going. Here we go. Let's do this thing. 
many Pokemon lost their lives. Well then why are you doing it again? All systems are go. It all seems very rude that you're doing this. Just saying. Hello, Lysander. The ultimate weapon's flower has finally bloomed above the soil. Don't you find its beauty captivating? As we speak, it draws its energy from the legendary Pokemon. Sean, I apologize that the weapon was unearthed even after you chose correctly in the lab. But conflicting egos drive this world. Things don't always go the way that you want. We're not going to let you use the ultimate weapon. Even though resources, space and energy on this planet are limited, the number of people and Pokemon has increased to an unsustainable level. Whether it's mountain... Mountain? Money? Or energy. The ones who steal are the ones who win in this world. But that doesn't give you the right to destroy everyone, but the ones Team Flair chooses. So tell me, the Mega Ring, did you share it? That's different. We competed for it, but... When there is only one, only one of something, it can't be shared. When something can't be shared, it will be fought over. And when something is fought over, some must survive without it. The only way to create a world where people live in beauty, a world without conflict or theft, is to reduce the number of living things. What about Pokemon? Tears? Why? Pokemon shall no longer exist. Pokemon are wonderful beings. Humans have worked with Pokemon and we have helped each other flourish. But pre precisely because of that, they will inevitably become tools for war and theft. Enough of this! You want to stop the ultimate weapon and I refuse to do so. So I'll keep you busy for just a moment. Alright Lysander, let's do this thing. Again. And you have seemed to have magically trained your Pokemon in the three seconds that we have been away from each other. Right, we got a Mien Xiao. I'm leading with completely the wrong Pokemon. Fantastic. Uh, yeah, I should have changed the Pokemon I was leading with. Oops. Alright, Ginger Beer. It's fine. We can do this. Oh, you've got Swords Dance! Fantastic. And I bet you have Rock Slide as well, so we're going to Mega. Uh, I'm going to use Fly real quick. I want to make sure I can take this thing down. But I can see a Rock Slide over a high jump kick, so we're just going to... Like, oh, you have Swords Dancing again. Ugh. <laughs> this fly really needs to take this thing down. Do not miss. If you miss, we've got a problem. Why would you do that? Okay. What a stupid, stupid thing to do. It wouldn't have mattered. I would have still probably KO'd you. Tough Claws plus Super Effective. It's, it's a no-brainer. Right, Gyarados. Here we go. Kola, it's your turn. This thing's going to have Outrage, which is presu presumably why he switched it in. Same as before. Thunderbolt! It's going to do a lot, but not a terrible amount. This Thunderbolt, however, is going to do significantly more. Uh, oh, is that Ice Shard going to KO, though? That Thunderbolt did about 300 power. And I've been Intimidated. So it would be 80 power with minus 1. Well, either way, I'm going to have to tank a hit. So I think I'm just going to go with a Thunderbolt just to be sure. I would... Oh, cool. I would much rather just make sure that I can take you down. Right, Gyarados goes down. Polar up to level 51. Pyro, we're going to stick around, actually. Just because that Hyper Voice last time did quite a lot more than I wanted it to. If I do have to switch, then it's not a problem, because I know that, obviously, Ginger Beer can tank a Flamethrower. It's not exactly like that's a problem. But I would like to see how much the Flamethrower does, actually. Oh, you've got Fire Blast! Oh, well, that's much worse. That's completely fine. Right, Surf. 
Fire Blast is worse, but nothing that's nothing that Cola can't deal with. Right, Pie Roar goes down. Hunch Crow. Let's switch in Ginger Beer. Apart from a Sucker Punch, Ginger Beer should be outspeeding this thing, and I don't know if the Dragon Claw will KO. It should do. Although Honchko does have quite a lot of HP. Cool. Awesome. Well done. The strength to protect, huh? What are you really protecting? A tomorrow that will only end up being worse than today? Which is better than you. That's essentially what this is. You're as strong as ever. But it's too late. There's no hope for you now. Go down to the lowest floor and see for yourself. It's not over yet. Shawnee, let's look for the legendary Pokemon. Trainers are protected by Pokemon, but they protect Pokemon too, right? Look, you can see the entrance to the lower floors over there. Yes, I can see. Let's hurry. Do I need a heal? I could do with a little bit of healing, yeah. Let's use a Mimi Milk. We're going to keep Cola up front, actually. Hello! I'm afraid we're going to have to ask you to turn back. The legendary Pokemon is at the end of this chamber, after all. Why did you tell them that? Who would even do something like that? Well, oops. We got a Toxicroak and a Lipid. This is completely fine by me. I got a Surf with your name on it, everybody. Sucker Punch, completely fine by me. Bye, Toxicroak, you're not living that psychic. Taunt. Oh, poor Meowstick. Can't use Taunt. Uh, can't use any of its other moves now. I'd much rather use Surf and just Dispatch of that thing. Because Delphox is so much better. But hit me and I might I might kill you back. So, just, just letting you know. Bye, Lightbird! You fools! That's very rude. Okay, I think I'm going to switch up to Lemon. Actually, I feel like Lemon needs a bit of a bit of a chance here, and we'll have Shrimp to hold to um to hang back on if necessary. Even if things are just as we heard, I can't believe they're sending smart guys like us to run off some little Rattata that wandered in. We won't lose. You won't get one step farther. The trainers moving on to the next level will be Team Flare. Really? It's very confident of you. My neck trick. Oh, God. Every single time I have to look at a stupid main neck trick when I have Lemon out. And you've got Intimidate as well. Oh, great. This is a time where I really feel like I could use U-Turn. Oh well. Fake out. Thank you for using it on the main egg trick. That's useful. That's static. Rip. Can that still KO, please? Ugh. Do you know what I would actually know? I like. I can do this. This is the first, first and only time this will have ever be any use to me. Oh come on! Really? You had to deny me of that, didn't you? Frickin' hell. That would have been so nice to be able to get the frickin' Felstinger boost, but no. You just had to do that, didn't you? Ugh. Whatever. Will you stop hitting my B? Please. That Psychic want to KO. Oh, for goodness sake. Right, fine. I'm just going to heal. I don't really want to have to switch. Stop hitting my bee. This... Okay, well. 
That's going to hit my B regardless. Frickin' main ectric. They're always causing me problems. Right. Can we move on? Do you want to heal me? No. No, you don't. How rude. I'm use a Mimi Milk because I don't really want Lemon to be uh, having to tank any hits on that amount of health, really. Shawnee! Serena! I don't believe it. What are you doing here? I'm sorry. I know. I'm just going to slow you down. But, but friends should stick together. I'm the one who should be apologising. You came all the way out here, and I wasn't very considerate of your feelings. You are right. Friends should stick together. Shawnee, we should all go together, right? I knew you'd agree. Okay, Shauna. Shawnee and I will stay... We'll go ahead. Stay close to us, okay? Okay, thank you! Felt a bit more like Apu from Simpsons there, but... Hey-ho. Hello again. Our plans haven't succeeded just yet. We cannot afford any careless mistakes. Who's got that flair? Team Flair. Yeah, we've got that flair. Team Flair. Good. Yeah, good. I'm happy for you, I guess. A hound... Uh, hound doom and a scrafty. This is the worst possible... Worst possible thing. Because I really need to switch, but at the same time I can't. <clears throat> Otherwise, I'm going to have two dark type moves coming my way. And the Houndoom is going to have Flamethrower. Oh, Christ. Should I switch or should I not? I don't know. I don't want Shrimp to have to take two dark, uh, dark type moves. That's the only problem. And he's going to get outsped as well. Maybe that Me Meowstick will use... Um, Maybe we'll use Fake Out. Good. On the Hound? Oh, okay, well, fine. I'd rather use it on the Houndoom, but it's fine. Right, Foul Play on the Meow Stick. Good. I don't take any damage this turn. Beautiful. Nice. Right, let's try and dispatch of that Houndoom mega fast, shall we? Disarming Voice. I mean, that's good against the Scrafty, but it's still not going to do that much. Foul Play... That's a shame, because now I am going to have to take whatever hit this Scrafty wants to throw at me. And it's going to be a Dark-type move, because of the fact that that thing was out. What's it going to be? Let's get Reface. Okay. That's better. <laughs> right. Do you want to just hit that thing with a nice quick flamethrower, please? Good. Wow, that still didn't KO. At least it used Scary Face again. x Bye, Bye, Scrafty. Lemon up to level 52. <laughs> Those are admins. The male admins in this game are just hilarious. In fact, actually, the admins, whether they're male or female, are hilarious. Right. Uh, I think we're going to use Smarty and Caramel for a little bit here. Yes, I know we have to hurry and stop it, don't worry. I gotcha. Hmm. It's an electronic lock. What should we do? This might help. It's a device that helps you stuck helps you when you're stuck in a puzzle. Claymon gave it to me. An electronic lock and a puzzle are sold the same thing, right? Ta da! The lock opened! Oh, and the, the device actually broke. Amazing, Shauna. You and Clemon's device are both full of surprises. So, we're finally here. The legendary Pokemon is inside. Let's go help it. First, though, I'm going to just switch to Caramel over Smarty, because Caramel is better at tanking hits. <laughs> Although, actually, I might have to look at a, a poison type. Mm, yeah, poison type's quite likely. We're going to go with Smarty. X. Ooh. 
We're in the deepest part of the headquarters. It's somehow hard to breathe in here. Hey, is that thing that looks like a tree the legendary Pokemon? It doesn't look like it's alive, but... Where the hell did you all just come from? That's none of your business, kids. The ultimate weapon has taken 99% of the legendary Pokemon's energy. But just to make sure nothing goes wrong, let's take these runts out! No! I hate being chased! Oh, Shauna, this again? Sean, you take care of things here. I'll protect Shauna. So, you really think you can beat us? Now, do I have to do you all in one go, or do I have... Because I don't... I want to be with Cola and Ginger Beer for, for the for the fight against Lysander, but I don't remember whether it's one after the other. If it's not, then good. Either way, we're just gonna... Good. It's not a main heck trick. That's good. I hate main heck tricks. Right. Okay. Surf. Taunt's fine. Taunt is fine by me. Ooh. Ice Shard. Ice Shard is literally one of the most useful moves, particularly considering I can get stabbed from it as well. There's the main neck trick. I thought you might have one. Just as a little little thing there. I thought you might have. Main neck trick! Right, Dragon Claw. Oh, the sleuth. How rude. How dare you identify me. Bye, main Ectric. Sweet. Ginger Beer up to level 52. Kicking very close to that level limit, but it's okay. You don't even try to understand Lysander and all that he suffers for. I'm suffering because I keep having to listen to you. Yeah, I thought I thought that this would be the case. I just have to um, just have to stick around for the last one. The last one is who I get locked into. Do you have a Houndoom? Oh God! Well, I'm actually leaving with the correct Pokemon this time. Fantastic! I hate these things, but this time I have Psychic. Yeah, stockpile, whatever. It's not like you things do anything else. You sit there doing the same crap all the freaking time. Spit up. Fine by me. Not going to do much. Okay, actually, that did a fair amount. Bye, Swallow. That was so much easier that time. Taking all the legendary Pokemon's life force is an unfortunate necessity to realise our goals. Well, why don't you just change your goals? Like Jesus. Taking all of the money and stuff for ourselves will make a team a world where Team Flare is happy. I think there are a lot of people like you in the world that, that do that kind of thing. Right, you've got a Mighty Enna, and I bet you've got a Houndoom. Oh, I'm definitely with the wrong Pokemon here. Uh, it's fine. The best move you're going to have is Crunch. Embargo. Well, that's annoying, but... It's not the worst problem in the world. Right. My Sienna goes down, and I bet you've got a Houndoom. And if you don't, then the last one does. Yeah, you do. I thought you did. I'd much rather stay in with Shrimp here, because <laughs> Lemon does not want to have to be looking at that thing. Ooh, I got a lot of damage. Can that Surf KO, please? Good. Oh, critical hit. Probably didn't matter, actually. Well done, Shrimp. Up to level 52, which is right where I want you. Smack, 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 smack. <laughs> Jesus. Always the same with you male admins. Right, last trainer then. So we need to make sure that we're with Cola and Ginger Beer, because these are the two that I want to be using. If you guys think we'll let you join Team Flare after all this, you've got another think coming. Now, was that a typo? A Golbat? My last battle with an admin and I've got a Golbat. Really? 
That's lame. You're lame. Alright, Ice Beam. To have Ice Beam at this point in the game is so nice. Oh, well, fine. Ice Shard then. Slightly depressing that that didn't KO, but it's okay. Whatever. It's also slightly annoying that... Oh, actually, it's not going to matter because I'm going to get the experience from Xerneas. Never mind. No way! This puts the no in no way! Contact Lysander. Call for reinforcements. It's time. Now, it should be noted, I don't want to tango with this Xerneas. So, one of... Something's going to happen. Let's watch. Here it comes. This is the first time I've ever actually watched this on X. Because I've only ever played Y before. Here it comes. God, I love Xerneas. Boom. It's turned into active form. There he goes. She, he, it. It's, it's, it's neutral gender, so. I'm trying to work out with. I think that scene was actually better with Evil Toll. I love Zernia, so. Right, now unfortunately, this battle scene and theme are both amazing. The big problem is the fact that Xerneas is ridiculously powerful. It's getting Master Balled. Um, I have said before that I'm not going to use this thing, but I'm Master Balling it just because of the fact that I don't want to have to look at it. <laughs> it's going to hit uh, do a crap ton of damage, and I don't want to have to deal with that. So, it's, it's fine. I don't want to... I don't care. I'm not using you... Um, it's just, yeah, you're, you're not, you're not happening. You're not getting nicknamed because I'm not using you in this playthrough. Do I get healed? No. No. And yes, it is okay. What a relief. Now they can't use the ultimate weapon. You're amazing, Shawnee. A legendary Pokemon wanting to be your friend like that is unbelievable. What a startling development. I never would have thought you were really the chosen one. What are those weird flies? I don't get it. So this is the mighty Xerneas. I expected more from a Pokemon called a legend. You desire help from people? You need help from a human? Well, what's going on with that outfit? Is that really you, Lysander? Oh, whatever. Shawnee's already beat you. What are you doing here? For me, victory is using the ultimate weapon. In order to do that, I need to reclaim the legendary Pokemon's power and send it to that weapon once again. I'll be taking the legendary Pokemon back now. This time, I won't lose. I, too, shall use the Mega Ring and Mega Stone that you researched during your travels. Here it comes, the final battle with Lysander. As creepy as ever. Right, leading with Bien Xiao. <coughs> Um, I am leading with the wrong Pokemon, but provided it doesn't decide to use Rock Slide, which I really hope it doesn't. It probably shouldn't, because I'm weak to fighting more than I'm weak to Rock, so. It might use Sword Stance. Oh, hi, Jump Kick. Fine. I expected that. Right, we're going to use Fly. Fly, fly away. After we've Megged, of course, because we don't want to be sticking around for our Rock Slide. No way. This thing's going to be outspeeding me, so the rock slide's coming. It's going to hit... Oh, you're just going to use high jump? Okay, that's much worse. Okay. Whoo! <laughs> don't want to be looking at that. Are you choiced or something? I don't think you are, but why would you do that? Right, Mien Chao goes down. Color up to level 52. Fantastic. Uh, we've got a Pyro. We're going to be switching...
Here we go, Cola. What intrigues me is the fact that he didn't switch into Gyarados that time. Um, this is completely fine. I actually need to use a... I'm on the wrong one. Uh, I need to use a Hyper Potion because I really don't want to have to be sitting around on that amount of health for Ginger Beer. No way. Right, here comes the Fire Blast. Now, how much is that going to do this time? Oh, and you burned, really? Is that necessary? Okay, well now I really do need a heal. I think I've got a full restore somewhere. I do. No, wrong Pokemon! Oh my god. Is that burn going to knock me out? <sighs> Holy shit, okay. We've still got another full restore. Cola! Goodness me! That was very scary. Right, another Fire Blast. You're going to run out of those before too long. Okay, Surf. I wish you'd miss one. That'd be nice. Sw oh, really? Oh, for goodness sake. Now, are you going to heal or what? No, you're not. I didn't think you were, which is why I thought Ice Shard's safer. Right, Pyroar goes down. Right, Honchcrow. Um... I'm not actually sure here what would be better. Because I have a feeling, a pretty good feeling, that that Gyarados is still going to have Outrage. And I don't really want to have to be tangoing with that. Right, this Honchcrow is going to hit quite hard, but I do outspeed it, so I'm not too fussed. So I am going to quickly use a Hyper Potion on Cola real quick, because I want to make sure that he is fully healed for that, um, that gross little thing. That was a critical hit. Really? Please tell me you don't have Brave Bird. I didn't think of that. Okay, never mind. Crit your back. <laughs> Take that, super luck nub. Right, and here comes the Gyarados. We're going to be switching into Cola. We're unfortunately going to be doing less damage this time with Thunderbolt, but it's okay. I would much rather have Cola in here. Intimidate is not a bother. I hope. Hopefully it doesn't come down using Ice Shard. Right, the Gyaradosite. Mega Gyarados. Now you're going to have Crunch, which is going to hit hard, but... Yeah, you do have Outrage. I thought you did. Still not quite doing half, so that's good. A Thunderbolt's... It's a, what, a four-hit KO, I guess? The fact that you have the Outrage is the reason why I was like, no, I can't, I can't switch, holy sugar. Can you not do that? Jesus Christ. These freaking things drive me up the wall. Right, Hyper Potion again on Cooler. If you could totally hit yourself in confusion, that would be beautiful. Ha! Fantastic. Right, we can totally tank an Outrage or a Waterfall or a Crunch or whatever you want to throw at me. <laughs> you just hit yourself again. Right, good. And Thunderbolt! And there she goes. That's all she wrote, Gyarados. Mwah. It's over. Fools with no vision will continue to befoul this beautiful world. That sounded like freaking Arnold Schwarzenegger then. They will go on until the only thing left to do is to squabble over the remaining scraps of hope. I love the fact that they still give you money. Um, no, I think even if there's only a little bit of something, it's still best to share it. Even if you managed to use Mega Evolution, that's because Gyarados shared its power with you, didn't it? And not just Gyarados, but your other Pokemon too. The legendary Pokemon is gone, so you can't use the ultimate weapon anymore, right? You don't have to worry about the future all by yourself. I think everyone should work together to make a be better, beautiful world. If that were possible... All wars would have ended long ago. I can only see one future. 
One where selfish, foolish humans think about nothing other than themselves and steal more and more from one another. It's a tragic future. The original purpose of this device was to bring a Pokemon back to life, but the ancient king transformed it into this ultimate weapon. Hmm. When the legendary Pokemon awakened, it took back much of its energy, its power, that it's been sent to the ultimate weapon. There's not much power left, but there is enough to use it once! Sean, Sycamore's pupils, let us live forever. That's right, I shall grant you eternal life. I'll give you the pain of endlessly waiting for a beautiful world to finally be built. Sean, Shauna, let's get out of here. Here it comes. Although I don't think Lysander has quite thought this through. There it goes. Oh, look at that freaking sky. Boom. Just destroy itself. Doesn't even technically destroy itself. It's like, nope, I'm done. Bye. Rip. I guess it is destroyed, or at least covered with rubble. Phew, I'm so glad you're all safe. I really respect the courage and kindness all of you showed. Thank you, we're all fine. Are you guys all okay, Tierno? Yup, as you can see we're doing great. Thanks for asking. We worked together to save the Pokemon connected to the stones on Route 10. I mostly left the battling with Team Flair to Cena and Dexio though. Who are these Cena and Dexio you speak of? We're the masked heroes! Don't worry about it, Tierno. We were doing all the we were all we were all doing the best we could to stop Team Flair's plans. Oh, we have a little bit of news for you all. We managed to destroy the machine in Lysander's lab that was spying on people's holocaster transmissions. So we won't have to deal with Team Flair anymore. Now I can go back to filling up my Pokedex. So it's finally over, right? We can go back to our adventure, right? Let's go back to Anistar City and start from over where we start over from where we left off. Thank you, Shawnee. I have so much respect for you as a friend. It's because I respect you that I want to beat you in battle as your rival. I really mean it. A long, long time ago. A very long time ago. The man made an ultimate weapon. Using it required the life force of many Pokémon. The Pokémon granted eternal life learned this. The resurrected eternal Pokémon left the man's side. The man was surprised and sad. He had revived it so that they could be together. Day after day passed, but they were never to meet. Eventually, he became a mere shell of a man. A man condemned to wander forever by the light of the weapon. And a Pokémon that also wanders eternally. Where is it now? What do I have to do to meet it? There we go. So, the Team Flare saga is all but done. Thank goodness for that, because I thought, Jesus, that's going to be very... <laughs> I thought that that battle was going to be a lot worse than it was. Luckily, that Pyro scared me just a little bit, but... Well, also, I guess the Gyarados did too. Let's not do that. Right, let's fly back to Anistar. Let's go. Good stuff. Awesome. Right. Well, I think we're going to save there, and I think we're going to end the episode off right there as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this episode. Please feel free to leave a like, rating, comment, and subscribe. You know the deal by now. Comment questions down there. And yeah, I shall see all of you guys next time. Have a great one.